Hello everyone, this is Darth Paradigm. I'm hoping that you're having a really good week. I'm uh, going to try to keep this video as short as possible. It's just going to be a little bit of a review on this uh, hilt that I picked up from uh, Potter Sabres. And uh, it's an LGT hilt. You can find it on the LGT store. And I will link the... Uh, the location, you know, where you can find this on the LGT store in uh, AliExpress, if I can locate it. And that way, if you want to get this hilt, you can go ahead and pick one up. The theme of this little hilt is it's kind of a, a take on the Fallen Order design, made into a very short form. I'm just calling this my Fallen Shoto. And Potter Sabers uh, basically painted this up, weathered it. And uh, the, the the job they did on this, it, it kind of looks like it has a bit of a patina. The photos from outside, uh, you know, I was hoping that the lighting would capture uh, said patina. But you might be able to make it out from, uh, from these shots. If we're at all lucky purchased this hilt it came with a blade plug as you see here and it has a standard uh, smooth swing core nine sound fonts typical fare from LGT this one has a USB port instead of the normal barrel shaped uh, port so um, if I do want to uh, swap out the uh, core I can do so but I have to find one with a matching uh, uh, matching port and uh, it has the system where um, you can just secure it with this one screw the one near the seam there and then the other screw uh, pushes the uh, pushes the board with the switch and the port up through the holes in the hilt uh, so you have clear access to them now um I will go ahead and turn this on just so you can get a sense of volume okay so you have a kind of salt and pepper shaker style pommel here Just so you can get an idea of what we're dealing with volume-wise. Now, I'm not entirely certain if the LGT version comes with a uh, cover tech wheel. This may have just been something that uh, James from Potter Sabres had added to this hilt. But if I kind of go along the uh, side here you can see it has a lot of uh, similarities to uh, the, the basic aesthetic design of the Fallen Order Saber measures in at 10 and a quarter inches and that's sufficiently long enough for uh, for two-handed grip or you know one-handed grip. It's a very light hilt. Uh, it's made out of aluminum, and uh... and there you have it. Well, that pretty much wraps up this video. <laughs> I didn't have much to say about this thing. I just wanted to show off basically the uh, the weathering and the uh, the work that you know James from Potter Sabers put into this thing, and the price that I paid for this right off of his website was uh, not bad, not bad at all. It's very economical. Uh, he had four. Uh, 
of what he's calling apprentice size hilts available. I purchased one, the post office lost it. I purchased I purchased another one. Um he uh refunded me for the lost saber, so no harm, no foul. Hopefully he got his money back from the post office via claim because that hilt is lost which is a real shame because that one was quite nice too uh i believe he has one left so uh i'll put the link to potter sabers and if you want to uh grab one of uh one of these you can't get this exact one but the one that he has is uh very similar as far as the the work that he did on it now Potter Sabers does do uh, custom installs. This is a uh, kind of you know standard fare with a LGD core. Really, all he did was the you know aesthetic you know attributes that you see here. Um, but he does installs full installs on Sabers, um, complete with his own chassis, and he uses Golden Harvest uh, version three. I think he has a few Profi. Uh, a lot of the hilts on his site are sold out currently. But um, you know, there's still a there's still a good array of uh, sabers that uh, you might find interesting. He actually has a um, a uh, Jedi uh, Revan uh, hilt that I've been kind of hoping that I could come up with the money for, but um, things have been really tight lately, uh, as you all know. <laughs> the, the economy uh, uh, is well, it is what it is. So anyway, I'll leave it at that. Uh, thank you for uh, joining me for this review such as it is and uh hope you all have a wonderful rest of the week may the force be with you and i'll catch you guys in the next video take care bye